Momo. The Momo. The Momo. Momo. Approach for Ghana for listen to Ohima B this and every Tuesday evening 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. UK time for our evening talk show The Man Komo. Join the conversation, family issues, social issues, our Munsem, child upbringing, about Aya Munsem, a man to Tia Munsem, a fear shells, a memasuka moon. Don't miss this show this and every Tuesday evening 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Listen to a man Komo on top online. Radio UK. You can watch the program live on Facebook at Top Online Radio UK. You can tune in to us by visiting our website www.toponlinestation.com or you can download our radio app directly from the Play Store or the App Store. You can also tune in to us on Modern Ghana Radio, Ghana Web Radio page, mytuna.com and all third party radio platforms. Join the conversation. What Jun Chen is saying, don't miss this show. This and every Tuesday, 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Only on Top Online Radio UK. You don't want to miss this. A quantum moon, sir. A quantum moon, sir. A quantum moon, sir. Twenty four in an asshole, Top Online Radio UK, I did a quantum moon some program of Bremo. This and every Thursday, eight to ten PM UK time. Join Mammy Plumine, Plumine PC, and Top Online Radio UK, twenty of us. Then you can watch a friend, join Mammy Plumine. This and every Thursday, 8 to 10 p.m. UK time. Only on Top Online Radio UK. Don't miss this show. Make a date with Mame Plamine. This and every Thursday, 8 to 10 p.m. UK time. On Quentio Munsem. Quentio Munsem. Quentio Munsem. Only on Top online radio UK. Top online radio UK. We will be streaming live on Facebook and YouTube. You can also listen to us on our website, toponlinestation.com. Tune in live on our free mobile radio app. Download the radio app from the App Store and the Play Store or go to toponlinestation.com. Thank you, Monsen. for it's time. It's time for In His Presence. This is DJ KB, Top Online Radio UK. And this is our second program for the evening, In His Presence. I we are featuring Reverend Jacob Van der Poy. And he is Reverend Jacob Van der Dear as you see Viano Ibusia, God is here and He will uh, be with us through the program. So without wasting my child, let me bring Reverend Vanderpoy. Welcome to In His Presence. How are you, sir? I am blessed. Thank you. The Lord is good. <laughs> How is the family and the network? All is good by his grace. The Lord is doing great things. All right. So, Reverend, where are we? Let's hear what the Lord has for us today on this edition of In His Presence. Amen. Amen. Thank you, DJ KB, and happy Easter Monday. Happy Same Resurrection. To you, Resurrection to all of us, top online radio Amen. listeners. You are welcome. We encourage you to share the link. Share the link. We've been treating the churches at Asia, Asia Minor. Uh, presently, it's Turkey. Uh, uh, when you hear Asia Minor, it's referring to Turkey. So far, we've done few. We've done the Loveless Church, 
uh, in the Ephesus church. We've done the persecuted church and we've done the compromising church. And today, the Lord is going to take us through another step from uh, uh, Revelation chapter 2, verses 18 to 27. We will establish the word of God. But before then, let's pray. Let's pray and seek the presence of the Lord. You are welcome, like I said. Let's enjoy in his presence. For in his presence there is fullness of joy. Our Father in heaven, we welcome you into our midst. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we thank you for the finished work at the cross of Calvary. We thank you for things that was done on the cross. We thank you for the redemption. We thank you for the restoration from Jesus Christ and for the on Calvary. The Bible says they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. And they did not love their life even unto death. Tonight, may there be healing. May there be an awakening. May there be the power of God demonstrated in your life. The Lord meets every person, every family at the point of our need. Father, we pray that as we deep increase and you will teach us your word, for your word is a light unto our path and a lamp unto our feet. And your word brings understanding to the simple. In Jesus' mighty name, we thank God, and you are welcome. Amen. 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 So we will take a scripture, and we will explore it. Uh, Revelation chapter 2, from verse 18 to 27. It looks a bit lengthy, but when we are patient, the Lord will uh, reveal unto us. He reveals to redeem. All right, so it's Revelations, so, Revelation two, 2, verses yeah, 18 to 27, please. 18 to 27. All right, 18 to 27. Okay. I will read from the New King James Version. Starting from 18. And to the angel of the church in Theatira oh. write, These things says the Son of God, who has eyes like a flame of fire, and his feet like fine brass. I know your works, love, service, faith, and your patience. And as for your works, the last are more than the first. Nevertheless, I have a few things against you, because you allow that woman, Jezebel, who calls herself a prophetess, to teach and seduce my servants, to commit sexual immorality, and eat things sacrificed to idols. And I gave her time to repent of her sexual immorality, and she did not repent. Indeed, I will cast her into a sick bed, and those who commit adultery with her into great tribulation, unless they repent of their deeds. 23. I will kill her children with death, and all the churches shall know that I am he who searches the minds and hearts, and I will give to each one of you according mm. to your works. Now to you I say, and to the rest in Theatira, as many as do not have this doctrine, who have not known the depths of Satan, as they say, I will put on you no other burden, but hold fast what you have till I come. 
and he who overcomes and keeps my words until the end to him I will give power over the nations 27 he shall rule them with a rod of iron they shall be dashed into pieces like the potter's vessel as I also have received from my father Amen Amen and 28 says and I will give him the morning star if he let him what the spirit says to the churches oh at the church at the church at theater hello uh, Reverend, I think your your camera um, is off. Can you check your camera? Okay. 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 Yeah, it's, okay. it's back now. Sorry, 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 viewers. Uh, at the church at Tia Teria or something like that, <laughs> uh, it was a worthy church. The first uh, item and the first identity of the church was that it was the worthy church a worthy town the town itself was worthy and on the Lycos river in the roman province of turkey today we will say mm -hmm. turkey and the law says i know i was all over we treated Ephesus. The Lord says, I know your works. As Nana, he says, I know your works. At Pergamos, he says, I know your works. So the Lord knows what goes on in the church. And individually, the Lord knows our heart. And the Lord directed John to make it clear to them. And there were qualities listed in the verse 19 there were qualities I, I think about five he said i know your love and i know your faith i know your studies i know your patience and your greater works that tells you and me that though uh, those uh, christians were on fire for god if god says i know your greater works all your prayers, all your morning devotion up to the things of God has gone, has gone to God as a memorial. He knows your works. Mm -hmm. He knows that you love. He knows that you are faith. He knows that you, you are serviceable. And he knows you are patient, long-suffering. But he says, I have this against you. So, child of God, man of God, woman of God, in your perseverance or in your serving of the Lord, you may be on fire for God. You may be the, a pastor. You may be the elder. But check your relationship with God. And the time they gave to the church at Teatira is the corrupt church what is corruption corruption is that dishonesty setting dishonesty or bribery or doing things to favor us and they 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 adopted the spirit of jezebel what is the spirit of jezebel the spirit of Jezebel is seducing spirit. To seduce somebody, it to bring somebody to a level to do what is contra. And the Lord wants them to be repentant. They have unrepentant spirit. And there was destruction awaiting them. 
Gethsemane spirit is idol worshiping, idolatry, and sexual immorality. When you talk of the queen uh, Jezebel, he, 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 he diverted people to paganism. So there was corruption so much that the Lord revealed to John the Apostles that I know thy words. Even though you walk in love, even though you have faith towards the things of God, even though you are serviceable, and today it's very clear and it's good to have faith. It's good to love God. It's good to be patient and it's good to have greater works, and that was accounted to the church. But some of them digressed. Some of them went into the spirit of Jezebel, the spirit of seducing, the spirit of destruction, an unknown spirit. For John the Baptist told us clear, some of God. Repent that. So that the word to the church, are we living for God? Because you love the things of God, are you fully to the things of God? Things that please you. So he said, <coughs> repent therefore, repent, repent. Spirit of repentance. We pray tonight that the Lord would break our step to our uh, corrupt attitude. Corrupt is dishonesty. You call black red. You have advantage over somebody and you want to turn the situation to favor you. Whereas this is not the issue. The scenario is that be honest. In addition to you loving the Lord, be honest. Be honest. And Bible says in Matthew 7, I think that's 16. He said, by your fruit, they will know you. By our fruits, they will know us. Tonight, you love God. Uh, 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 check. You love God. When you assess, you love God. Thank God you love God. When you assess, your faith is in God. When you assess, you are serviceable to the things of God. You are patient. <coughs> you are doing greater works for the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. But he, he has somewhat against you. Hallelujah. He says, uh, nevertheless, I have few things against you. Because you allow, you allow that woman Jezebel, when you are seduced, it means that you are not thinking right. To be under the influence of a woman or a man. <coughs> it can be a man or a woman. You are not under the influence of the Holy Spirit. But you came under the influence of someone else. You are being seduced. And they direct your thoughts. Even though you go to church, you succumb or you surrender to everything. And he says, that one paint your heart. That one repent your heart in the name of Jesus. And tonight, mm. we want to read something, a very popular scripture about Christian living. And you will see some of the qualities that we read in uh, Galatians. Twenty two and twenty three. Galatians five twenty two to twenty. Clearly, that the church are 
criteria they were really in love, faith, service, patience, and greater works. But there were some things. So if we read Galatians 5, verses 22 to 23, please. All right. Galatians 5, 22 and 23. I read. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Against such there is no law. Amen. 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 It says love. Uh, the church qualified. Because the qualities they gave them, they say they were a church of love. And they say uh, joy and peace. Faith is also the fruit of the spirit. Faithfulness. They were faithful. They were patient. But self-control, when we read the spirit, uh, uh, the fruit of the spirit, it says we should have self-control. And when you are seduced, it means you don't have self-control. Self-control, may we have self-control in the church. Self-control will cause you not to be corrupted. When you are seduced, you will be corrupted. And in the church, they were corrupted. So the spirit of control, we pray tonight. May you be able to control yourself. Amen. And he says, long suffering. Endurance. We need long suffering. Patience and long suffering, they inter rehat. But yet still, you can be patient and you are not lost suffering. So they had a spirit of Jezebel. That means they have no self-control. Tonight, it is our prayer. Christian man, Christian woman, have the spirit of self-control. Amen. Because God is warning you against the spirit of unrepentant spirit when you don't have self-control you need to repent when you don't suffer long you need to repent even though you are in the service of god re check your heart check your mm -hmm. heart and assess your life ask yourself am i living the life that pleases God. But, uh, 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 am I uh, doing some of the things that pleases God and some of the things I have closed my eyes? The spirit of Jezebel. Why do I am on it? It brings about seducing. It brings about idol worship. But say I do not worshiping. We think if you have erected something or you have something you bow to idol, idols. Some people they are kind of idols. Some people they cherish their work. It's in I did not come on the radio station and go. Set the priorities right. People worship their work in well has become an alien. People they attract things. That's why the other day, Jesus, in Matthew, you see, verse 33, 
first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all other things shall be added unto the case. That, that's where the corruption can go greed. They walk their way through the opportunity to be honest. When they say this is the uh, uh, qualification or this is the late people in the area, they were corrupted. It was a worthy town. People prospered, but through their prosperity, child of God, out of corruption, come out of worshipping of some they worship their husbands, some they worship their wives, some worship their heritage, their inheritance. They believe in properties so my ways of God have no effect on their life. They cannot die for the work of God. That's why uh, 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 Revelation says, ah, they did not love their life. Even they overcame by the blood of the, uh, of the Lamb and the word of their testimony testimony and they did not love their life even unto death how many of us today pastors high bishops bishops reverends can on the work of when i mess a bed nigo they will not worship your god we will not bow something they say. They say we, we will not worship. The God of Israel will deliver. But they went to the Speak to me, Lord. Speak to me. Speak to me, Lord, speak to me, I'm not leaving this place, until you speak to me, I'm not leaving this place, until you speak to me, I'm not leaving this place, until you speak to me. I'm not leaving this place. Material things. Exploitation of people. Some people, when they have position of leadership, all that they do is to exploit their, uh, 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 their genius. It's corruption. And corruption is right in the church. Let me set my heart. Let you set your heart. Do you use your position against your, your uh, subordinates? Are you uh, uh, directing everything to your, to your place? So all that they know is to love the things of, of the world. So he said, repent, repent, repent. There is spirit of repentance. He said, if you will not repent, I will, I will destroy your, your church. And some of us may go to so Some of us, we're doing the things of God all right. But the Lord, he said, I gave a time to repent of the sexual immoralities. And she did not repent. Spirit of repentance. Oh, thank God we are in the festivity time. Thank God for the death. Thank God for the barrier. 
thank God for the resurrection of Jesus Christ. He buried our sins. He took away our shame and our pain. And by his Christ, we are healed. Amen. So, are you repenting tonight? Are you saying to God, my heart will be connected to your work? Are you saying, I will suffer long? Are you saying, I will have self-control? Are you saying, I will wait upon the law? For they that wait upon the law shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and they will not be weary. You will walk and you will not faint. Somebody, this is no time to faint. Somebody, indeed, I will cast her into a sick bed and those who commit adultery with her into great tribulation unless they repent of their deeds. Your deeds are before God. My deeds are before mm -hmm. God. Spirit of adultery, spirit of fornication, spirit of lies. Mm -hmm. For there are some things that the Lord hates. And I, 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 will, I will bear, I will employ uh, our uh, DJ to help us read uh, Proverbs 6. Proverbs 6, uh, I think, 19 to from 19, yeah. Proverbs 6. Proverbs 6 and verses, verse 19. Let me see. And from 16, 16 to 19. Proverbs 6, 16 to 19. These six things the Lord hates. Yes, seven are an abomination to him. A proud look, a lying tongue, a lie, um, hands that shed innocent blood, a heart that devises wicked plans, feet that are swift in running to evil, a false witness who speaks lies, and one who sows discord among brethren. Amen. 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 There are six things that the law is. And if you are corrupted, you can fall victim of all these six things. And a, 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 a heart that devises lies. Corruption brings about lies. If you don't lie, you cannot be corrupted. And corruption will create discord among brethren. When you are corrupted, so he's talking about corruption in the church. May we live to please God. If a man's ways please the Lord, he will cause his enemies to be at peace with him. Let's please the Lord. A heart that devises wicked plans, wicked plans, corrupt art will de de uh, devise wicked plans. Definitely, if your art is corrupted, you are capable of doing everything. You are capable of being mischievous. You are capable of planning and plotting against everything. So the, the Lord was not pleased with them. And the Lord is asking us to go back to our first love. To go back to our deeds when we fear what the Spirit says to the churches. Tonight, the opportunity mm -hmm. is yours. Tonight, the time is yours to reflect on your relationship mm -hmm. with God. The Lord is calling you and I that everything that will cause us to be proud, everything that will cause us not to have self-control, not to suffer long, not to be gentle, not to be meek, Oh, we, we, the qualities were there, but love and not being self-control amounts to nothing. Don't let your love go unrewarded. Don't let your service 
some of us, uh, and there is a saying, we say you are busy for nothing. Mm. Oh, if you go to church all the time, you pray the drums, you preach, and you don't live right for God, you are busy for mm. nothing. There is no reward. That's why First uh, Corinthians 15 and the verse 58 says, Be steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. For your labor of love in the Lord will not be in vain. Be ye steadfast, unmovable or immovable. Oh, the spirit of steadfastness fall upon you tonight. May the Lord direct my Amen. steps. May we be a church, a church without wrinkles, Amen. a church without brains, a church without dark spot. May we ask for forgiveness Amen. tonight. It is not easy, but if you ask God, he will cleanse you of all unrighteousness. And the Lord will perfect everything that concerns mm -hmm. us. May the favor of the Lord fall mightily upon mm -hmm. the church. May individual lives be directed to the things mm -hmm. of God. May we see the goodness of the Lord and the love of God be shared abroad in our heart. We will read our last scripture and we will pray. First John chapter 3 Verses 19 to 22. First John. First John. First John chapter 3. And verse. Verses 19 to 22. 19 to 22. I read. And yes. by this we know that we are of the truth and shall assure our hearts before him. For if our heart condemns us, God is greater than our hearts and knows all things. Beloved, if our heart does not condemn us, we have confidence towards God. And whatever we ask, we receive from him because we keep his commandments and do those things that are pleasing in his sight. Amen. 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 Let your heart be steadfast on God. When your heart believes and you ask God that you will cultivate the fruit of the Spirit, by, the, by, by you believing, you know the truth of God. And God does not condemn. It is your heart that condemns you. Oh, like the woman in John 8 when the, the, uh, the Jews brought a woman who they say was caught in the act of adultery. They were condemning the woman. But Jesus, who doesn't condemn, thank God he has paid the price for you and I. They say Jesus took. And Jesus started writing. Maybe he write first of all, Jacob Vanapoy, you tell lies a, a lot. Then I turned my back and left. <laughs> and then he write, Akosua, you've been stealing from your mom. Then uh, they were all men. So let me mention the name of men. And he said, Peter, for you, you've been changing the account figures at your church. And Peter left. And Jonathan, oh, the woman you are living with, have you paid a diary? And Peter left. One by one, Jesus let all of them saw their fault and left. And the, the woman was left by a home. And Jesus says, where are your accusers? He said, they are gone. He said, I condemn you not. Go and see no more. Tonight, we are not condemning each other. Let us go and sin no more. Oh, if you say there is a, a plank or a, 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 a stick in the eyes of your brother, 
You don't know what is in your eyes. Judge not so that you will not be judged. Any attitude, attitude of corruption, any behavior that is not pleasing in the sight of God, tonight we take authority and pray that the Spirit of God will lift Amen. it from us. We pray that the Lord will cause us to be strong in him and to be directed Amen. in him. Repent, therefore. Repent. It's a time of repentance. A time to go before God and say, God, I love you more than you love me. My, my presenter, I, I don't like going overboard. If there is something or any prayer you want us to Thank pray. You, sir. I think um, we can pray for, um, once again, for our children who are on vacation, who are studying in different um, mm -hmm. levels of uh, inst institution, education. Education. Yes, and also pray for the sick as well. Thank you, sir. Amen. Hallelujah. <laughs> Child of God, are you repenting? Is your faith stabilizing God? Tonight, Christ has done the finished work at the cross of Calvary. It is all paid for. He says, Father, forgive them, for they don't know what they are doing. And the penitent a, 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 a criminal, they said two criminals were, were, were crucified with him. There was one called Demas. He was penitent. Penitent means he was a grateful criminal. He was ready to repent. He was ready to show remorse. He was sorry. And there was Gesta. He was penitent. He was ungrateful. He was rather challenging Jesus Christ. He said, if you say you are the Lord, how can you be on the cross with us? Repent, uh, 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 free yourself and free us. But the other one say, remember me. Are you saying, remember me, Lord, Amen. tonight? And he said to him, I will be with you. You will be with me tonight in Amen. paradise. May the Lord forgive our sins. We commit our children in all levels of uh, institutions. Amen. The junior school, secondary school, tertiary educations, we pray that the Lord will protect them. We pray that nothing will, will contaminate their education. We pray that goodness and mercy, the hand of the Lord will be upon them. The Lord will protect them. The Lord will give them wisdom and understanding. There won't be any peer pressure that will bring corruption Amen. to their lives. Lord, protect our Amen. household. Lord, cause your dew and the heavens to hoping that we will walk in love. We will cultivate the fruit of the spirit. Lord, revive our spirit. Lord, cause us for the kingdom of God is at hand so that we will repent. Repent, therefore, for the kingdom of God is at hand. Any sickness, mm -hmm. anything that has dominated mm -hmm. your life, anything that causes you not to have freedom, the pain mm -hmm. are going by the stripes of Jesus Christ, by the balm of Gilad, you are Amen. set free tonight. Who the son of man set free shall be Amen. free indeed. There is liberty. There is freedom in your Amen. serving of God. Oh, we come against the spirit Amen. of Jezebel. The spirit of seducing. Amen. The spirit of Antichrist. The spirit that brings about headstrong. Amen. Lovers of their own self rather than lovers of God. May the outpouring of the Holy Spirit Amen. be your portion. You are set free. You are redeemed from the curse Amen. of this world. You are restored to the joy of the salvation Amen. of God. The Lord bless Amen. you tonight. The Lord cause your work, the work of your Amen. hands to be blessed. 
Whatsoever you stretch forth your hands to do, Amen. be blessed. You are set free. Every divination Amen. spirit, every Amen. enchantment spirit, we cast it to the root Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Jesus loves you. Jesus wants Amen. you to come to Amen. him. Come to him, all you that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. May you have rest. May you have rest. Finally, give your life to Jesus. I know somebody will say, he, he, you, uh, we repeat it all the time. No, when one sinner is saved, heaven rejoice. You don't know Jesus as your Lord and personal Savior. I'm giving you the opportunity. Say tonight, by meditating on the word of God, don't be uh, 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 lose, have self-control. Say tonight, thank you, Lord, for your mercies endure forever. Thank you for the outpouring of your spirit. I therefore repent. I invite you into my life. Be my Lord. Be my Savior. With my heart, I'm believing unto righteousness. And with my mouth, I make a confession unto righteousness. With my mouth, I come to salvation. The Lord bless you and keep you. DJ KB, the Lord bless you. The Lord bless Amen. top and life. And all of you, God Amen. richly bless Amen. you. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much, Reverend. Amen. Van der Poy, a chief for dear listeners, viewers, that's Reverend Jacob Van der Poy. He's the leader of the Wailing Intercessors um, Network. It's a network of prayer warriors. So if um, you want them to help you with any prayer request, please call the number on your screen at the top uh, left of your screen, which is 07898. Seven two four one zero eight. That is zero seven eight nine eight seven two four one zero eight. When you call that number, Reverend, we'll be glad to uh, speak with you. Also, if you want to join that yeah. network, call the same number. Also, they have um, Zoom yeah. meetings on Wednesdays, and that is on Zoom, and it's Wednesdays. Um, in the evening and the meeting ID is on your screen at the moment is seven one six nine sorry three nine nine eight five zero four zero the meeting ID again is seven one six three nine nine eight five zero four zero and the passcode is two V for Victor, S for Sierra, 8 for number 8, then P for Papa, and A for Alpha. The passcode again is number 2, then capital V for Victor, capital S for Sierra, the number 8, capital P for Papa, and the small A for Alpha. When the time for the meeting, Reverend Minister, is again, is it 8? Seven, seven, seven to, to seven thirty. Sorry, seven UK time. UK yes, time. seven to seven thirty UK, UK time. So wherever you are, just do the calculation. If you are in Ghana, we are leading uh, Ghana mm. by one hour. Right. By one hour. So you can take a mm. screenshot of the contact details on the screen, and it will be easier for you to join. Thank you very much, Reverend. God willing, we come your way again next week with another edition of In His Presence. God bless you. God bless you, sir. Pleasure is mine. Bye bye. Bye bye, sir. Bye. A chief for those, Reverend um, Jacob Vanderpoy of the Wailing Intercessors Network. This program comes your way every Monday, 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Please make date and join the program and you'll be blessed we have the contact numbers of reverend van der Poy on the screen so if you have any prayer request uh, you can call those numbers and he'll be glad to assist you
Speak to me, Lord. Speak to me. Speak to me, Lord. Speak to me. I'm not leaving this place until you speak to me. I'm not leaving this place until you speak to me. I'm not leaving this place until you speak to me. I'm not leaving this place. Breathe on me, Lord. Breathe on me. Breathe on me, Lord. Breathe on me. I'm not leaving this place until you breathe on me. I'm not leaving this place until you breathe on me. I'm not leaving this place until you speak to me.
的心。